Hello guys, today I'm going to read a book called Dear Tooth Fairy. And before we start, don't forget to like and subscribe. Well, most of the kids believe that the two fairies are real, but they aren't. Let's start. Dear Tooth Fairy. So this is the first page after reading. Holly's tooth was wobbly. It got wobbler and wobbler, and then it fell out. I could give it to the tooth fairy, she thought, and get a coin. But Holly liked her tooth and wanted to keep it. So she put some plastic vampire fangs in her pool instead. The tooth fairy should be happy, because she's getting lots of teeth, she said to herself. Next morning, the vampire fangs were still there, but there was a tiny of them too. So this is how the envelope looks like. Well, not really the envelope. The letter in the envelope. We need your teeth. While you're asleep, you received a visit from the tooth fairy. I was unable to take the tooth you left me because it was not a human tooth. It did not come from a child. It did not belong to you. It was made of the wrong material. Please leave the correct to under your pillow. I shall return tonight, tomorrow, next week, never in a million years. The tooth fairy. Wow, that was an interesting part. Right, guys? If yes, hit the thumbs up. Now this is the next page. Wait. I hope you can see. Yeah, so let's see. Holly read the note from the tooth fairy over and over. She was so pleased. I must write back. She thought this is what she wrote. Dear tooth fairy, thank you for coming last night. I've never had a visit from a tooth fairy before. Could you answer some questions, please? What do you want my tooth for? How, how did you know it had come out? Are there lots of tooth fairies, or are you the only one? Where do you live? Please answer. Love, Holly. B.S. I drew a picture of you. I hope you like it. Holly put her letter in her pillow. So this is the next page. That night, the tooth fairy came back. See the tooth fairies on her nose with the shimmery glitter. Let's oh. read this. When Holly woke to enter her pillow next morning, her note had gone. It is placed with a new envelope. Number two, tooth house. Flower and fairy wind. Dear Holly, question questions. We two fairies are very busy, you know. Luckily, there are lots of us. Each night, we fly higher and higher around the world from a honey fairy land, collecting teeth. Human teeth are very useful for fairies. They're white, or fairy colored, strong, and last a long time. At the moment, we're using the tea to build a palace for the fairy queen. I knew your tooth are falling off because the tips of my wings twinkled. If I think twinkled at all, which means yours is a very good tooth, you must have been looking after it very well. I look forward to seeing it tonight when I return. Please sleep and I'll be oh, the tooth fairy. But yes, your drawing was very good, only a little too green. Put it in the envelope. Ooh, that's a fancy envelope which said Holly on it. That's her name. You heard it. Holly reads the letter and looks at the leaflet. She thought about all the tooth fairies flying higher and higher through the starry sky. See, this is a really starry. You can see the really bright star over here. It's a twinkling star. On that day, Holly wondered about Fairyland and what it must be like. She wrote another letter, another note to the Tooth Fairy. Dear Tooth Fairy, thank you so much for your letter. I'm glad you like my picture, but please don't be cross. There's just one more thing I need to know. Well, two things actually. What? Are there lots of different sorts of fairies? And what do they do all day and night? If the fairies were my tooth, I need to know that they will be good on it. Don't I love Holly? That night, the two fairies visited once more. 
Let's see. Meet the fairies. Two fairies. They collect and look after tea. Water fairies. They keep the water clean and sparkly bright. Tree fairies high among the branches. Tea fairies look at keep watch for nest tree to its peepsies. Their merry music makes the fairies dance and sing brownies. Their airy bacon keeps the fairies well fed. Ball caps. They are. They are always looking to make mischiefs. Wallow whips. They are twinkling, glow bright light to fairyland. Flower fairies. They are magic, gives color and beauty to the flowers. Elves, small but strong. They carry heavy loads upon their shoulders. Toe fairies only joking. <laughs> Bye guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. This is just part one. I mean, two.